on today's episode. Come with your little shorts. Is that Carissa Kardashian coming through? That was really embarrassing. Mom life, don't talk to me. You're coming home with me. Mommies don't even got prescription. Wow. Like, I am in heaven right now. I love you. Ew. You're 20 weeks today. a cat in the windowsill. Look at it. <laughs> Grande vanilla latte with an extra shot and soy milk. Be good. Be good. Be good. Can I have a pop cup for him, please? That was embarrassing. That was really embarrassing, and I hope you're embarrassed. You don't lick it until I say. <laughs> Do you, like, actually deserve this? <laughs> Do you think you deserve to have the pup cup, or do you think that you probably shouldn't? <laughs> okay, you can have it. You can lick it. L slow licks. Okay. <laughs> Bagel a day keeps mama happy. Okay, you guys. So I recently got so many new clothes. I'm gonna do a little, you know, bump inspo. We're gonna do a little fashion pregnancy edition type of haul. Okay, we're starting off with this moment right here. This is my vibe, my style. It's comfy, like comfy, comfy. <laughs> So we just have a basic bandeau, we have basic sweats, and then to spice up the outfit, we have on these really dope shoes. Like, I'm obsessed with these. So freaking affordable, and they look like the Dior high tops. Converse hot tops, what? Hot tops. <laughs> high tops, what am I saying? They are hot though. Yes, I'm obsessed with this outfit. It's like a little bit edgy, but it's just comfy and cute. And if I'm taking my outfit to the streets, by the way, if I'm editing some blue light glasses moment from Shein, so cute. I love blue light glasses. I love glasses. I used to always pretend like I needed them when I was younger. I literally have like perfect vision. But I add a flannel on top. This one's more like a jacket. It's very heavy and like insulated. So it'll actually keep you warm. This is more for winter vibes. I think this one's from Windsor. But it's so cute and it goes with the entire vibe. Like I'm going to Barnes and Noble to get myself a latte and to read some books and educate myself. <laughs> but the bump isn't really like too visible in this outfit. So if you still want to be like, you know, mama on the low, there you go. Also very random, but this is from Forever 21. And oh my goodness, I'm obsessed with it. I'll show you it with like a much cuter outfit. This is more of just like a comfy, cozy outfit, but butterfly clip and it has these like jewels. I've been saying I want to go darker. So I feel like with dark hair, that would like show up even better and be so cute. And then I got this exact outfit in white. As you can see, I'm covering my tatas because I'm not wearing a bra and you can see them. But real quick, the bandeaus came in a three pack. So I got white, gray, and black. The sweatpants came in a two pack of white and black. And even add like a blazer to, you know, Hailey Bieber it up, spice it up. Blazer smells like, um, <laughs> period blood. It looks cute though, but probably wash this before I wore it. And is this my style that I would normally go for? Absolutely not. Tell me this is not like a Hailey Bieber outfit or even like a Kendall Jenner. I don't know. Am I, am I hyping myself up too much? Ooh. These big chunky sunglasses are a vibe. This is like mom life, don't talk to me. I was pretending to drive a car there. My Range Rover, my, my G-Wagon. Not me being like completely out of breath. It's so cute, look at her. I'm obsessed with this color, it is everything. All shades of green have been so stylish, so trendy, and I'm obsessed with like a longer dress like this with some higher boots. I have some 
thick legs, like thick, 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 and these have room. Yeah, this is like a sweater dress, and bump is bumping. Oh my gosh, okay. I am obsessed with this one, first of all. It makes the bum look nice and peachy. They're high-waisted and they tie, so perfect for the bum. And then this top, like I'm literally not even wearing a bra, and you can't even tell. Maybe you can. <laughs> More comfy, cozy vibes. Let me show you guys the softest, coziest. Oh, you just have to see it. Hold on. I'm gonna show it up close. Look how comfy and cozy and soft this is. Okay, wow. Like I am in heaven right now. This is so cozy. There's pockets, there's buttons, and I don't know, I'm obsessed with this. I love being monochromatic and pairing nudes on top of nudes. I feel like this is like the perfect little blend of neutrals. And it has like this like flannel detailing to make it like look like it's a flannel. But if you did want to pop a color, how adorable is this? I definitely stepped out of my comfort zone with getting the color, especially something vibrant and pink like this. But ever since I found out I'm having a girl, tell me like how this makes any sense. I want to wear pink more often. I don't know. I thought this was like fun, cute, simple. But this is really good quality too. I love all the different shades of pink. She's spicy little outfit this dress is actually the exact same dress as that darker green one i showed you guys in the beginning but of course you guys know i'm obsessed with my neutrals so yeah i'm obsessed and we have switched back yet again to the edgy sporty look i am obsessed with this though this dress like is amazing for bump fashion like look how good it is i paired it with those like high top sneaks again you could definitely do like air forces or you can dress it up with like black boots or something. I just thought this was so cute. Look at the bump. She is bumping. You know, she does two different vibes in today's video, I guess. <laughs> I think the next outfit, we're actually switching back to the other vibe. So let's go see. I love my little bump. Girl, is that Carissa Kardashian coming through? <laughs> it's just this unitard one piece and it's ribbed and it's so flattering and it just cinches you in but it still accentuates the belly this is stunning this would be so pretty with like a bunch of gold jewelry where's my bag first the kardashian can't find her louis vuitton bag but you know you get the vibes and then if you want to just you know cash it up a bit daytime look it we can add a flannel on top and this flannel goes perfectly because it has these like nice and warm chocolate colors flannel is nice and like oversized so it gives you room to move around it it's not too tight i can't stand a tight armed flannel ew i love this look and of course the boots just make the fit so much more glam you know and then we have this color green i feel like this is so pretty more of a sage color and look at these earrings oh my gosh there's like a pink pair like a lime green sage green some gold bunch of different flavors and you get how many pair i think this was like maybe two three dollars sage color dress and hold on we have it in pink here's the pink dusty rose color if you want to go for more of like a monochromatic action you can do a cute cardigan on top they had this cardigan in so many colors i just loved this one it was like girly and cute and oh my goodness these earrings too this like pink color dust color even this would be so girly and cute there's pockets this is so cozy it's not itchy i am shook do we see what I see? Are we noticing this booty pop? So when it comes to leggings for me, I will spend a pretty penny on leggings. I will spend money on leggings because they are so worth it and you get so much wear out of it. I wear leggings every single day. So for me spending money on leggings, I would way rather do that than spend money on like an outfit. And Shein has such affordable options. So like buying outfits and stuff from Shein is always like a great choice. But when it comes like active wear, like I'm willing to spend more because I want the quality for it because I wear it so much and you know, blah, blah, blah. But this is pretty freaking good of an outfit, especially these leggings. Now this top, like look at my tatas. They look good. I am pregnant and I am you know growing rapidly but she holds them in pretty good this is from the glow mode collection and i love the concept of this top it could be a little better quality it kind of feels like a swimsuit almost like that type of material this style is so flattering i feel color is everything very cute lemon lime but these leggings holy crap like they definitely like suck you in right here like i feel let me just let the belly out there you see and then this booty pop is like really good. I don't know how long they're gonna last for. They feel like they're pretty thick and really good quality. They do seem maybe a slight bit see-through, but honestly, not bad. And I just can't get over the scrunch bump. Like they understood the assignment. 
I swear there's not that much more. I want to show you guys the last two things I got from Shein. And oh my goodness, they're just two little things for baby girls. So I'm going to go get them. They're so cute. <laughs> this cute onesie. It's color blocked. Neutral colors. And I just think it's so cute. I love the lining of it and the buttons, the ribbed material. It also comes with these little shorts. <laughs> guys, I am so obsessed with baby clothes. It's terrible like i'm obsessed like i get my high squeaky pitched voice and it's just so cute it came in so many colors but like i said i want to keep it just neutral and then this outfit i cannot it's a three-piece little set comes with a cute bow and then it comes with this long sleeve onesie with the little puffy shoulders the ruffle shoulders i'm going to not squill over these pants bell bottoms i can't oh my goodness i cannot wait to dress her up and do try on hauls with her like i literally don't even care if you guys come at me telling me to stop buying her clothes because i'm not and i'm obsessed so yeah both of those from shein so cute i think they were like maybe five to ten bucks oh my gosh okay so i got a few things from forever 21 i also have some active wear from rider wear i'm obsessed with rider wear you guys know my favorite active wear brand ever love this so cute very affordable but rider wear always takes the cake and then oh i got one outfit from play-doh's closet that was actually princess polly i'm aware i need to wear a bra okay but this moment this all white moment body looking like milk are you guys ready <gasps> I can't. This is so cute. I'm obsessed with the cinching detail here. The belly looks cute in it. Same thing with the top. Covered the tatas. But wow. This is a vibe. I'm obsessed with all white. You're like not supposed to wear white or something after Labor Day. I don't know. I don't pay attention to that. This isn't white. This is cream and it's from Zara. I got it last year. But I feel like adding this on top is so cute. Wow. Yeah. Yes. This is cute, sis. I love this set it's so comfy and this was on the rack at play-doh's closet i went in there sold my clothes saw it and i was like you're coming home with me you guys saw the tiktok okay i keep referencing tiktok but <laughs> i'm obsessed i don't really have like an outfit to go with this so i figured i'll just show you this adorable jacket i got from forever 21 it's like this corduroy big puffer coat I got so many coats because I plan on going to Wyoming during the winter months and it's freezing there so I need to be like bundled up, you know, and this color is everything. I'm obsessed. Wow, this is the most comfortable thing ever too. So comfy. Nice and puffy and soft. The corduroy vibes. Okay, I love. Next we have a dress from Forever 21. <gasps> I am obsessed with this dress. How stinking cute. The ruffles, the flowiness, the side cutouts. Like, I can still wear these side cutouts while being pregnant. At least in this dress. But, oh, it's so cute with the bump. The back is all out. I love these, like, puffy sleeves right here. You can wear this with Air Forces. Like, make it casual, some booty. Like, this just, like, really makes my eyes pop. And I just feel like a little mom in this. So, I definitely want to get some wear out of it. I'm going to get it in because it, it's so cute. I'm obsessed. This color is everything. Rider wear does it every single time. Look at this workout set. It's so good. <gasps> I love it. Okay, so the top is a small. I think that I might have to start moving up to the mediums because <laughs> these boobs just keep growing and I don't want them to fall out when I'm working out, you know? So they do have adjustable straps and they're nice and thick too. They're not super thin. Show you guys the back. Guys, do I still have my muscular back? I haven't worked out back in so long. I should probably do that today. I love how it says rider wear like that across. These are so cute. And these pants are so comfortable. Oh my goodness. They're so stretchy. Like I can still move around in them. Squat, of course. The belly looks good in them. But these are still a size small bottoms and they are so stretchy. Okay guys, I am done finally. I have been hauling for how long? But this is the last thing I'm gonna end off with is just a super cute jumper sweater and it says Ryder on it. Love the color, pink. And then these are just some Staples scrunch bum bottoms. Look at the scrunch bomb. That is going to end this super long haul that we just did. Hopefully I can speed it up in editing time. Yeah, hopefully you guys liked everything. Everything is linked down below for discount codes. I also have all those linked down below. So save yourself some coin and you'll be supporting me with some of them as well. Mm -hmm. 
Look at my mess. <laughs> Another thing I really have to do today and I can't make any excuse is go to the gym. I skipped yesterday. Skipped the day before too. Can't wait to edit with these. I was like, where in the heck is my Bible? I forgot I was using it as a tripod. Like the disrespect, I literally can't. But yeah, this is my Bible guys. It's always, always, always linked down below in every video. Talked about it before, but it kind of just like dumbs down the Bible. Every time I say that, I'm like, that That sounds really bad. Um, not dumbs down, but it basically just makes the Bible easier to read. It puts it in terms that you can actually understand. I'm going to be filming a like Bible study routine. I have this whole morning routine that I've been doing. And it's all surrounded by like how I spend time with Jesus in the mornings and like before I do anything. So <sighs> let me catch my so I'll definitely be filming that in a future vlog like as soon as I get back because all my stuff's there. I only have my Bible and my Bible reading plan with me right now. But all like the extras and like little things I do that make it fun and that make it like, you know, more of something to look forward to than just pulling out a Bible and reading it. This is my Bible in a year reading plan. So it was my goal this year to read the entire Bible. And if I stick on track, I should be done by December 26th. I'm trying to read ahead sometimes because I don't want to like take the chance of not finishing this year. Like it's definitely like one of my biggest, biggest, biggest goals. Look at me acting like I'm going to put my reading glasses on. These don't even got prescription. In. Hey. <laughs> I took a snooze and Jesus, please forgive me. I still didn't do my Bible study. <laughs> I woke up literally starving. Like, that's what happens to me quite often being pregnant. But like I was saying, I've been waking up with like the most intense hunger pains. Like every morning I wake up starving for my bagel. And every night, or every nap, I'm exposing myself now. I just always wake up very hungry. So I'm gonna make a big, huge, delicious. You're balancing on toaster salad. A vegan skiza. We love to see it. So good.